Quinnipiac shuttles are now heading to North Haven instead of Hamden, and town officials are not happy about it. It's a, a negativity we don't need. Um, I think the businesses are hurt because I don't see why um, you would stop running the shuttle. The change comes in the midst of an ongoing feud between the city and Quinnipiac. Although Quinnipiac attributes the change to a growing presence in North Haven, investing almost $300 million in its North Haven campus, Hamden Mayor Kurt Lang says it's just another petty gesture. Um, I actually don't think it's a petty gesture. I think it's actually more of a proactive way to create more of a relationship with the working community in North Haven. So, I, you know, I just think that it's a gesture to show that North Haven, that we're committed to a relationship with them. Dale Krupp says it's too early to tell if the switch will affect Hamden businesses, but others say it won't be as significant. I can't imagine that the, those numbers are, are really, uh, really large, that have an actual impact on the community. If anything, it's taking a small uh, portion of business away from those big corporations. The Hamden shuttle change to North Haven may affect Hamden businesses, but how does this change affect the different types of Quinnipiac students? The underclassmen, the freshmen and sophomore students without cars, it also impacts a group of international students. Um, there's a large group of international students who live in the apartment complexes behind Walmart and they um, no longer have um, public transportation access because of the cutoff of the shuttles. So I think that that's a concern that the university is looking into, absolutely, like they've told us that. So I think that like those are kind of the greater concerns for the students themselves rather than looking at it from the Hamden side. Right now it's a political kind of football and uh, hopefully it'll, things will calm down. Hopefully the, un the university could just restore some of the bus service to um, the shuttle service to the stores. Kenesha McFadden, Q30 News.